this this is too much for you to understand this is not for your brains this is not for your theological correctness this is spirit before doctrine you are called first to worship in spirit God is spirit they that must worship him must worship him in spirit first and in truth there is too much truth in you that you don't know the spirit I'm talking to you you are watching because you want to judge what we're doing by your knowledge of scriptures this is the spirit is a wind you can't predict the direction it comes. He that is born of the spirit is like a wind. And you cannot predict. You can't hold. This is the impartation of the latter roar. Roar of war in the heavenly realms. Authority in the spirit. This has nothing to do with money, materialism, or physicality. No. This is spirituality. We are unlocking the inner man. We are unlocking, sir. Hold on, sister. We are unlocking the inner man. I'm done. I am done with pretentious churches. You're talking about a God that you cannot represent. You can, you're talking about a God you cannot manifest. Aren't you supposed to be in the image and likeness of God? Why is it that the God aspect of you has not been activated what's happening there is a spirit in man that is connected to god and must envelope and rule the outer man this is not for your senses this does not make sense this is spirit enough of men living like natural men you think Hold on, sir. Hold on. You think that men who control this world are normal? They die with Satan. Some of them teleport into underworld. Some of them do things you can't believe it. They can't believe it. Some sacrifice children. Some kill to be able to summon spirits to control the world. Some of them are serving Satan himself. And the only way we can overcome the coming darkness is the activation of the human spirit. If you don't get it, you're lost. I don't care who you are. You can be in any religious position. If you don't get this, that God promised to pour out his spirit upon flesh, you think that the Holy Ghost will come upon you and you're gentle. Nobody receives the outpouring of the Holy Ghost on their bodies and not vibrate. Nobody sits on fire and not burn. Nobody puts his hand into a fire and not hot. You are hurt. It will hurt you. Yes. Nobody enters the water and not get wet. So, when this power comes upon you, there's a vibration of spirit. There's a vibration of the body. They are defecting the latter. It's coming. They say it. Perado. Shisio. She's here. She's here. She's here. She's here. Young people are being filled. Young people are being filled here. They don't belong to Satan. Young people in this church, in this move, not church, in this move, in this wings of the spirit, are being filled to dramatize the demons that possess young people. This ones are not touched. They are going to enter the pit of hell and snatch the souls of young people out of Satan and his control in this last days. Any young person that came here and decided to go back to hell, you went to hell. Nobody sent you to hell. You made a choice and that choice will catch up with you very soon. And then you seek God, he will not be found. Why? You made a choice. Young people are coming here, praying, filling with the Holy Ghost. 
you made a choice to go your own direction. Hear me out, sons of God. Whatever you're watching all over the world, if you have tested Christ and you chose the world, God will put you in hell. There, you will enjoy the choice you've made. Nobody influences your decision. You make decisions. God respects your decisions. And I pray for you that whatever you're watching in the world, stand for Christ. Stand strong. You are a soldier. War will come. Troubles will come. Tribulations will come. But put on the whole armor of God. Teleport into the dimension of that warfare. And we come out victorious. Whatsoever is born of God overcomes the world. And this is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. Go and establish the conquest of Christ. Go, my daughter, very young girl. Go see Jesus. Have experience with the things of God. Go.